Well, you know at the Monster Jam World Finals, gentlemen, you're going to have a huge encore. There was one in racing. The bonus by adding the extra day to the World Finals is now there's a special freestyle encore. What are they setting up for here? I don't know. First of all, how many of these things do they have? See, oh, look at oh. Oh. <laughs> Unbelievable. oh, unreal! Look at the height of that one. Look, look at this guy. That. I don't what know is... what I don't know what that Doomsday's doing. I don't know what that one's doing. But what I do know, Adam, there's no sponsors on those trucks. I, I I'm speechless. I don't know who's doing it. Here's what I know. This ending, this spectacular moment, the fireworks, another reason you've got to be at every Monster Jam World Finals. I can't even describe it. Like I said, it's like a dream come true. Uh, Sean and I have been on a roll lately. We've been killing it, and uh, to get a world title out of it, you know, our third year here, I'm, I'm excited, we're stoked. He just told me, he goes, don't even think about it, just do you. That's what I did. As soon as I come down that Thunder Alley, just my brain shut off and I just went into auto mode and just did a run and wanted to do a couple of flips and I did one. I thought, why not do another and just kept it going. I just, I don't know, Sean and I, we want to be known as the guys who go big every time and just want to make those other drivers squirm. But uh, I'm stoked. I got to get, get on the road, head back to Arizona to do an off-road race now. But uh, I want to come back for the awards banquet. We just got to figure out how to make it work. You know, no one knew what to expect, but it's kind of funny. There's a lot of fans kind of stunned that Todd LaDuke and Metal Militia won this championship, yet you get the impression that maybe Todd is more stunned than anybody. Again, that top three, Scott Buto finishes second in Team Hot Wheels Firestorm, and there's Max D there again. But as we get the final thoughts, Adam Anderson, your thoughts on Todd LaDuke and Metal Militia as the Monster Jam World Finals Freestyle Champion. He's a great driver, he's a great person. I love the way he treats our Monster Jam fans, and he earned it. He straight up earned it tonight. He made me feel like a sissy, man, because he went out there and he rocked the house. Yeah, the first time I saw Tattle Duke at a Monster Jam event, you know, I saw, you know, good, natural, great driver, you know, comes from racing background, and, you know, with Todd, you, I, you just had a feeling it, was, it wasn't, if it wasn't going to happen or not, you knew it was just a matter of time before uh, Todd was going to be a world champion. Great job by the Militia guys. Unbelievable night, as you would expect. 32 Monster Jam trucks, the biggest track ever. And Todd LaDuke and Metal Militia separate themselves as the Monster Jam World Freestyle Champions. Make sure that you're following the action all the time, whether it's on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, and of course at MonsterJam.com. And get ready to join us again in Las Vegas for our next edition of the Monster Jam World Freestyle Championship. And you can get your tickets right now. For Grave Digger, the legend driver, Adam Anderson. And for the Fox Sports 1 cleanest driver, Frank Kremel, I'm Scott Douglas. We'll see you at the next Monster Jam World Finals. See you later, 2014 World Finals, we did it.